morning guys and welcome to another paris vlog very bizarre to say but it is a last minute work trip which is really exciting i've been kindly invited by ellie saab to go to paris for pretty much 48 hours just under 48 hours to go and celebrate the launch of their new elixir fragrance my car is picking me up in 20 minutes and i'm heading straight to some pancreas train station to meet the girls and head off to paris for an incredible 48 hours of just fun and work and yeah very excited and i'm very very grateful to you guys that i get to do this trip because it's just so fun so i'm in my first outfit for what i'm going to be wearing today so i'm wearing my mango coat which i just i'm so obsessed with and if you haven't already purchased it definitely go and do so like i've had so many of you like send pictures of yourselves in the coat and i just absolutely love that you love this coat as well and it does come in black so i am contemplating getting the black because i feel like i wear this coat so much I know it's a good timeless piece and I like the the lightness of the material so that in the like spring summer wearing a black isn't actually too heavy or wintry it's just a really good coat and I've just paired my Chanel brooch on it as well which I just always do and then I'm wearing a really nice Massimo uh, not Massimo Duty Me and M cardigan which is really pretty um just done up with some new trousers that I picked up from and other stories yesterday and some heeled boots so I'm ready to go I've had a coffee I've had a banana she's all prepped the house is clean but very organized so yeah just gonna go and wait for my car hello guys in the car <laughs> just made it to paris and we're heading off to lunch where are we going again brat 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 which is very exciting we're in. Back in and we're yeah back in paris this back one's been paris. three times already third time third time guys can you believe third time lucky, third time lucky. <laughs> so yeah so we're heading to lunch now with the team yeah. and yeah i've start the paris vlog i can't speak i need coffee yeah coffee <laughs> and amelia will be i'll be back, back in, in the, the room, room. Oh, yeah. who knows <laughs> show me what it's like to be circling among the clouds because without you by my side i would be stuck here on the ground wow you're lighting up the way I can see the road ahead of me I won't be stumbling in the dark Your eyes are shining like the stars Oh wow, that's so cool! Whoa! I've got the money shop right here! There's chickens! <laughs> Hi chicken! You've got a fancy little home! <laughs> oh there is a hot tub, wow! Feels like I can fly. So we've just gone for lunch at a really lovely restaurant and now I'm heading up to my hotel room. I am 4.01. So let's do a little tour. Oh my goodness. Oh my. Oh, this is stunning. <gasps> Holy. Oh my God. This bathroom is insane. This is incredible. This is beautiful. Little cookies. Oh, I wish I could eat those. And beautiful flowers. Can I take these home with me? Oh my god, on my balcony. Whoa. Okay, so <laughs> I've just rocked up into the most incredible hotel room ever. So I thought I would give you a little tour because I think I was in so much shock that I just didn't know where to start. Um, so we are staying at, I can't remember the name of the hotel, but it is absolutely beautiful. So I thought I'd do like a walk-in tour to show you everything because this is just incredible. So you walk in here, we have the machine, which is this place. Oh my god, thank god there's dressing gowns. I am so cold. I'm gonna put a dressing gown on. We've got some lovely pillows, and then you walk into the most incredible hotel room. Oh my goodness. Look, this is just for me. Can we just take a moment to know that this bedroom is just for me? And there is a bath. I would absolutely love a bath. Oh my goodness. 
the double sinks. It is incredible. It's like this beautiful marble and the lighting is amazing. Oh, perfect. I have a mirror. I love these mirrors in the um, bathroom. I think they're just so handy. <laughs> That's perfect angle. And oh my goodness, we've got some fragrances. So they've got the B signature fragrances and a like bath salts, which is lovely. And then you have the bathroom and the shower. Oh my God, I love this black and white tile. And then a little private bathroom. Wow, hair dryer. This is incredible and it's got all these mirrors. So you're all ready for all the angles. Lovely jubbly. This is insane. So yeah, we've literally just been, we've literally just arrived. I'm literally, I'm really flagging. I don't know what's wrong with me at the moment today. So we went for a really lovely lunch at Brack, B-R-A-C-H, and it was like the most incredible rooftop view. Food was amazing, like a really nice Lebanese. And I had a tuna salad and we shared some like hummus and broccoli and bits like that. That was really lovely. Now I'm going to get ready as we are meeting, India and I are meeting at half six to do some shooting. So I think what I'm going to do is freshen up, redo my makeup, do my hair and film a little reel of me getting ready. And then shoot and then I think I need a glass of something because I feel like I'm just flagging. Um, so I'm gonna have a quick shower, zhuzh myself, put some music on and get in a really comfy dressing gown, get some video content and then yeah, enjoy the evening. It's been just such a lovely day with the girls and the Ellie Saab team and yeah, really excited for this evening and, and then sleep in this hotel room because look at that, that is incredible. So yeah, let's get ready. Okay, I am showered. I am getting ready. I was going to film a reel of me doing my makeup, but one, as much as this hotel room is beautiful, not the best of lighting for kind of like a close up showing you what my makeup's going to look like. To be honest, I can't really see what my makeup looks like in this mirror either but um i just thought i would do some kind of like here and there kind of like talking to you guys what i'm doing and the style of makeup i want to go for i'm currently having a cup of tea because i don't know what's wrong with me at the moment honestly I, i'm having a really weird day and i don't know if it's because i'm exhausted i've, I'm, I've got <laughs> i've got slippers on as well and i've got a dressing gown on and i've got a peppermint tea i just i'm just a bit overwhelmed i'm not gonna lie like um i feel like crying I don't feel like crying. The last kind of few days have been really hard actually, like just mentally, like I've just been really struggling. Um, no, I don't know why I'm crying. Oh, sorry, I just got a bit of emotional then. Um, yeah, I've just been finding the last week or so really hard, I don't know why. Um, I'm crying now, but I'm okay, I'm okay, I'm all good. But I'm just, I'm just having a cup of, cup of tea. I'm in my dressing gown. I've had a shower. I think I need a drink. I think I need just a little bit of TLC. Um, I've been really enjoying the Fenty foundation. That's been really lovely on my skin. So I'm just going to do another pump of that. But yeah, I'm just really exhausted and overwhelmed at the moment. I'm not too sure why. Um, and I know this is supposed to be a really fun vlog. But um, kind of bringing you back down to earth. As, um, I've been really struggling recently with my mental health. So um yeah i'm just trying to take it try and take it till chilled for a bit and just kind of get on with things and work and there's so much i really want to do and i think that's eating at me and yeah it's been a bit of a hard one so we shall see but anyway i'm very excited to be here and i'm with the really lovely team for the ellie Saab fragrance it's a pr company called phoenix and they are just the loveliest and they've taken such good care of us we went to a really lovely restaurant called Bratch, which is incredible. I will leave, um, I've got a guide on my Instagram of Paris recommendations, like restaurants, but also things like I've started to add, like there's um, City Wheels, which is a really nice way to explore Paris, where you get these vintage cars and you go and explore Paris for like an hour or two and you can have champagne and it's just like a really pretty way of doing so um, and you get to choose like what area of Paris you'd like to drive around and it's so so beautiful so I would really recommend that as well um, but I would definitely leave the 
restaurant and this hotel and everywhere we go on my guide as well as down below but yeah i'm really excited for tonight it looks incredible the events at the restaurant giraffe which is a restaurant that you can go to publicly but ellie saab have actually hired it out for an event which is just incredible in itself so that's gonna be really exciting i just need to try and get my lip balm so yeah so i'm just gonna get myself ready and maybe put you on a quick time lapse because i don't know how much i'm gonna film of paris and tonight hopefully a bit hopefully my stomach is gonna calm down because it's been feeling a little nervous and i've been eating really random things today so i'm hoping by the time i'm ready and zhuzh i'm gonna feel a little bit more myself when you make that smile i'm moving closer to you now i can't get close enough somehow makeup done i'm just putting on a little bit of just a little bit of glow on my skin this is the beauty pie like creamy highlighter and it is delightful like so and then i'm going to put i am going to put a little, a little bit of lip liner on i'm either either going to just go in with a dark nude maybe i should try my outfit on first or i have a brown lip which i feel like could look really cool just to have something maybe like a little bit different let's have a look so this is painterly by lisa eldridge and i just thought dark lip oh i like that maybe i do that i might just do some soft waves oh i like that color on me so that was painterly by lisa eldridge that is no <laughs> um but it's a really nice color and it's a good like buildable one and it's not too heavy so yeah that is my makeup done and i think even my hair as well i quite like this kind of undone feel so i'm gonna try on some outfits and see what we think uh, and i was down until you save me until you set me free my eyes were closed now i see clear as day and i just wanted to say okay. we can take it feels like i can fly i don't need anybody i don't need anybody else take me no one will ever take me away from you i promise i will hold on to you i don't know what i'd do without you i've made myself at home at india's india's house to be fair though we need that door open for our chips we do we've just ordered chips and mint tea and india's discovering these are these doors are ridiculous they are like the chunkiest doors ever also i feel like i haven't really caught you up with no way. yeah look, look. Guys, no way how See cute those are the biggest doors in a hotel room i think i've ever seen who designed this wow look how curved know. they are i feel like i actually haven't caught you up with what with what has gone on so we have just got back home what? and actually my skin's looking all right you look gorgeous thanks honey God. we've just ordered some chips and mint tea we had a fabulous night we so we went to bratch for lunch which was a really cool hotel restaurant incredible rooftop so it's like a multi-universe of things to do definitely the rooftop in the summer oh my god the view of the eiffel tower i'll try and leave pictures on the screen and then we came back we shot and then we realized <laughs> we shot we shot and then we realized like we thought we had enough time to do everything and i was planning to have like a 20 minute nap but we didn't that just my belly's rumbling oh. um so we got ready really quickly and then we ended and then we went straight to the basically we're here for the launch of this is literally i feel like this work this event this whole trip has been a whirlwind yeah but basically we're here with ellie saab the fashion designer they also have a fragrance branch and they've just launched a new fragrance called elixir which is beautiful and i feel like with you guys on my channel that you quite like my scent of like od smoky kind of vibes this is a really nice like I'd say this is quite a nice like summer scent for the ones who like are quite a musky 
fragrance would you say like yeah it's very floral but it's got that like undertone of being quite evening-esque like musky yeah OD. and when it kind of is on you you get that instant kind of like floral scent but, also but then like it goes into lime? that very limey very yeah like citrusy yeah it's got and neroli in it which i do like it's a very you perfume i have to say out of all yeah. of them that i have it's the one that i was like amelia's gonna like this the most for something which is floral mm. i quite like it i do really enjoy it yeah it is gorgeous and it goes yeah. off you i was saying earlier to like quite a musky scent yeah so it's quite nice when it fades because yes it yeah it goes it just fades so nicely the first the f i literally look so snug right now <laughs> the first the first scent of it is very citrusy and yeah. floral but then yeah you're so right it calms down mm. into a really nice like odory musky tone Sleepy. so yeah so we were there for that and it was incredible and the venue was at giraffe which is an incredible i cannot believe we haven't gone for lunch there before honestly do we go back there tomorrow <laughs> We could. We could we walk could in and there. say, do you have anywhere for lunch? Because yeah. that restaurant I would love to try. Yeah, food. I feel like, and the view yeah. of the Eiffel Tower is just insane. Guys, book that if you're going to Paris. It is beautiful. Wow. And it's like one of the places that everyone does recommend. Yeah, they do always. It's just, yeah. I always think it's very fully booked. Is that just, maybe I'm... Maybe. I mean, outside in the summer will be, be phenomenal. Yeah. Like, phenomenal. But we were there for the event and it was just... So we've had a really lovely yeah. night and they were just serving Perrier Jouet, which is one of my absolute favourite champagnes. So obviously I it's used like and abused that. Literally water like, to me. <laughs> it just goes down a treat, doesn't it? It was lovely and it was just a really cool event and I just both very grateful for being here. Like I mean amazing. what the hell? I Guys, know. Pinch us now. Who would have thought? when we met little us two also i have a manif manifestation board yeah, i'm gonna try and show it i feel like my manifestation boards just happen and i just it scares me sometimes how do you i did a picture i'm gonna try and show you a little bit but there's the eiffel tower and it's literally where giraffe is that's mad and we were literally taking flash like photos of the eiffel tower absolutely mad and it was like I was like, this is on my vision board, but it was like kind of during the day, but same, same. I, so my board had, so this happened to me last year, guys, yeah. just very quickly. I'll do the short version no, of no, last no, year. Yeah. But I, at the, the, at December last year, New Year's, I basically printed up this like 3D thing and I wrote all these countries down that were like my goals. And this is so bizarre, but last year I went to each of those countries in order of order. that list. And my mind was blown. So this year I did the same. But the top one that I did was City Breaks times four. Pa Whoa. And this is times three in Paris. Well, do you've done Paris three times in one month. Where am I going next? Where is she going next? I mean, I did just do Edinburgh. Honestly, so maybe that was the fall. Honestly, manifestation is just, like, it's... It was... Yeah. Honestly, if you haven't started manifestating... Manifesting. Man manifesting. I like that better. Manifesting. <laughs> manifesting. Manifesting. Yeah. I don't recommend it. What does that mean? All I the emotions it. and everything is coming. This is a very raw vlog. I kid Aww. you not. Yeah. Um, but anyway, long story short, it's, it's been a great evening. It has. And um, we're just ordering peppermint teas and chips. And then we're going to have a really nice strolling. Oh my God, it's going to be so I'm nice. really excited for tomorrow. Just yeah. like having... I feel like with city breaks, we were saying that like you feel like I'm literally rambling now, but you feel like you have to have an agenda of like filling up every hour of every moment of the day. There's always just a lot so going long. on, isn't there? Yeah. yeah, and with this, I feel like we're like, oh, we actually have a spare day to do nothing. Yeah, we have no plans other than just walking. Yeah, and maybe finding somewhere that does wine and chips. <laughs> We just like wine and chips. Is it just me or in your camera do our team looks <laughs> We're like Ross from France. I know, I was like, why? No. Maybe it's the It must be the t how do I turn the TV off? You've got to help me with that before you go. I mean they look great. They do look good. I'm gonna edit it back and we're gonna look horrendous. Oh goodness me. But anyway, we're gonna wait for our chips and and wine. Tea. Tea. Oh dear. No more Tea wine tonight. Chips. But I'm excited for breakfast tomorrow even though we've ordered chips. Excited! But anyway, it's been a pleasure. It's been a treat. It's been a treat. It's been a time. And this hotel this is just... on the pillow. What the phenomenal. Shall I eat it?
Hold on, it's stuck, guys. <laughs> Should we do a taste test? Taste test. Is it dark? Is it milk? Who knows? We're gonna find out. Oh my god, it's like an advent calendar. <laughs> <laughs> wow. It's kind of weird having to Never seen bed. so much, so excited for it. But I'm shop. starving. We haven't I'm eaten. Starving. We've I've had three cubes of sushi. I've had three meringues. <laughs> we, oh yeah, we've had meringues as well. That's, what, that's it. Guys, I'm the biggest foodie ever as well. Actually, yeah, me. I've actually eaten more than you tonight. <laughs> but did you not want to try the sushi? It, I didn't. It didn't hit me. Oh, it didn't come round. It was so good. It was avocado I and it, salmon. I it. Anyway, should we find out where our chips are? Yeah. Tara. I think like it's here. Hello. Good morning, guys. It is the next day now. I've just got myself ready. I'm wearing a very lovely outfit and I'm very excitingly happy to share with you I'm doing a really exciting collaboration with Laritzia for some Gani boots which I'm going to talk to you guys about after breakfast but I'm just going to quickly head down and meet India for some coffee and breakfast. We had a very fabulous night last night and had a little bit too much to drink and not enough to eat um, so I'm very glad we had those chips. So yeah gonna head down and have some breakfast and then I'm gonna come back up that's India and um, do some last minute content before we have to check out I might have to get another coffee I'm gonna save mine hello guys so we are out fresh air ready to go we're just walking down one of the main roads where like Arts Triumph is just behind us we're just having a mooch around we're gonna walk down here, maybe go shopping, go to the Eiffel Tower, and we might try and find an Instagram coffee shop, not too sure which one yet, and sit there and be the the, the influencers that we are. <laughs> Get some coffees, hot chocolate, and yeah, just enjoy the last few hours in Paris. Oh, this is the Louis Vuitton, little Lou. Do you like this collection? It's a very funky collection. I think it's cool. It's fun. I think it's cool, I think it's fun. I don't know if I'd invest in it because I don't think it's as like, It's very trendy. Yeah. Time. Well, I mean, you guess you can wear it for all seasons, but I don't, for me, no, I don't know. It's very 101 Dalmatians. Oh, it's so cute. Without you. We're doing all the Instagram things to do in Paris and we're at Le Jour. Le Jour or Le Jury? Le Jour. Getting some macaroons. We're taking it all off. <laughs> Feels like I can fly. This is just heaven. Literally just walking down the street which is full of Chanel, Saint Laurent, Louisville. Can take me Good morning guys, I am coming to you from a very cold and snowy London. I am heading out the door, it is just about to go 7am and Holly and I have a personal training session at Jab which we are loving. Jab is such an incredible boxing studio just off of Bond Street, it's down Audley Street. A really lovely hot spot, really good for um, for shopping with the Selfridges and there's a massive Zara there's a Joe and the Juice there as well um, so we are going for an 8.15 class at Jab and then we're going to do some work and then we have a appointment with Farfetch which would be really cool so yeah so a really busy back to back to London after Paris day I've done my brows quite dark I don't know if that looks a bit silly but we'll leave it alone but yeah I just made myself a coffee I was going to make it for the journey but I need a coffee right now and it's a little bit cold so I'm all wrapped up ready to go and yeah let's start back to work well I've been working anyway in Paris but back to the UK with a jab class and it's just been snowing which has been really pretty <laughs> Healthy, healthy. My hands are actually shaking after that class. Good morning, guys.
guys i am still feeling a little bit low but i have had the loveliest delivery from my mum and dad which is my favorite flowers how pretty are these oh my goodness they're actually from bailey and sage and it's actually a bouquet that my angel angel people joe and tara um gave me when i moved in and then i actually art requested for these to be done for my mum's birthday and full swing they've come back to me and i could honestly i could cry honestly it's made my day i actually also got some beautiful flowers from the charlie london team for international women's day which i haven't had time to share um but how beautiful and wild are these flowers i've never seen anything like it like how delicate are those um and i've just paired with my pookie light and i've just decorated the house but yeah I'm gonna get these beautiful flowers into some water. I'm thinking actually about putting it in this H&M vase because I think that looks quite cute. Just how beautiful are these flowers? They're my absolute favorite, favorite flowers. So I'm very incredibly grateful that my mum and dad surprised me with those and they just look absolutely Stunning. I'm actually going to keep them on the kitchen counter because I think that looks really sweet. So yeah. Thank you, Mum and Dad. You are the best parents in the world. I know you watch this, so I love you so much. I am just about to head out the door. I actually have a really lovely event with Versace, which will be really lovely. We're going to the Standard Hotel. I'm not too sure what um restaurant we are in but the standard hotel is actually one of my absolute favorite um hot spots in london i think the hotel is just incredible in itself the rooms are just insane the location at st pancras international is just literally across the road i actually stayed there with juicy couture once and i had the most insane suite with the most incredible balcony with a bath outside so i hope one day i get to revisit that bedroom because that was incredible but they do have a, a few different restaurants and bars i believe there's a bar called sugar which my friend and i went to which did incredible margaritas and there's a really incredible mexican at the top and then at the bottom i believe there's kind of like a lebanese easy brasserie kind of fusion restaurant which is really lovely as well but i'm there with Versace for their new fragrance which is a gorgeous purple color but i'm actually going with my assistant annabelle which would be really lovely to catch up with her because i haven't seen her in a while and yeah i'm really enjoying this brown lip that i have from lisa eldridge it is i wore it to the event i went with ellie saab it is painterly by lisa eldridge and it's a really lovely like balmy color it's not matte it's really creamy so really enjoying that against like really lovely beiges and neutral colors so that's what i've gone for wrapped up warm because it is cold outside and definitely taking an umbrella so yeah let's head to the event and catch up with some lovely people maybe have a glass of champagne or something rude not to and um yeah enjoyed the day my mess of a house um but yeah i've just got on my mango my mango coat i'm borrowing this little bottega pouch by holly um she doesn't know i still have it <laughs> um my cream acne scarf and i've got a silk weekday skirt on which i wore in paris these boots from river island and then i've just got my frankie blazer and my cami top underneath which i will show you another time actually i could share you the reel i did a little get ready with me on the side whilst i'm chatting so you can see the full outfit getting ready head to toe and then i've just popped re repopped these earrings back in i don't know if you can see these large um doina hoop earrings from monica Veneda. all my earrings are from monica Veneda. And then I have my um, SVP collaboration I did, the rings that I did a collaboration with Sarah from SVP with. So if they're still available, I will leave them down below. But yeah, just going for a, a very neutral vibe today. Show the vlog. There's a Versace fragrance in there. Oh no. There's a cup. That's really good. <laughs> I know. That's a genius. Good morning guys and happy Friday. It is nearly the weekend which I am very much 
looking forward to. Um, very much looking forward to. I'm gonna have a chilled one this weekend. I had some really fun like social plan, but I think at a stage in the breakup where I'm feeling like really, really, really sad now. It's been six months, I think. Um, and yeah, I'm just really hurt. Um, I mean, I was hurt the whole time, to say the least. But um, kind of like, it's like just really sad now. Um, so I'm kind of just trying to keep in tune with my little body. By the time you're watching this, I'm actually not too sure. It might be even seven months. Wow. Um, but yeah, I'm just trying to keep in tune with my little body and just do some really like wholesome nice things what's the time so I'm to do it. yeah i've got time because socializing in big groups i know it's just not right for me right now but like socializing in little groups oh goodness is lovely because i don't want to be on my own so so yeah so i'm trying to do things that i know i enjoy they're wholesome they're not like going out go clubbing and getting drunk it's like really nice vibes so yeah that is what I'm doing. I am just about to head off to my first ever Barry's class. Still got my clips in my hair because my hair went a bit crinkly. Um, my first ever Barry's class and it's in Soho. And then I'm off to a lovely breakfast with my friend, dear friend Lavanna from Elizabeth Arden PR. I haven't seen her in years since lockdown. She's had a baby. So it'd be really lovely to catch up. And actually she's taken me to Plants by Deliciously Ella which also is another place I've never been to. So a very lovely way to start the weekend and Friday and wholesomeness. Um, so yeah, so let's see what I take you along with me for today. And then tonight I'm going to Helen and Finn's as they're gonna be cooking me gluten-free. It's the Otolengu Ragu and it is incredible. And they're making it gluten-free for me, which will be heavenly. And then yeah, I've got a really chilled weekend. So, no going out. I'll have a glass of wine or bubbles, for sure. Um, but, but just, like, not heavy drinking, not heavy socialising. Just, like, really lovely, wholesome activities. And then I actually am trying a, like, a hot vinyasa flow yoga. Oh, no. It's a, no, it's hot Pilates on Sunday, which would be really nice as well. And then in between, I'm going to be doing some work and some project planning. And I'm really excited for it. So, yeah wholesome weekend decluttering as well and yeah just be present with how i'm feeling and take things slow early nights i might have a bath on saturday night and yeah she's all right just got to be in tune with what's going on with me anyway but anyway enough of the emotional update <laughs> i'm gonna have my coffee which i'm gonna leave actually on the screen i have kindly been given a discount code via Small Batch, which is an incredible coffee shop in Brighton, coffee company. And I mean, it, it makes me feel like I'm at home right now that I'm having Small Batch because they've been going for years and it's a coffee company that me and my dad always get coffee from and we absolutely love. And they've kindly sent over some coffee to London, which is really nice, I feel like, especially with what I'm going through right now. It's really lovely to have. Um, but they've given me a discount code to show for you guys that will get you 50% off. So, that is really good. And um, so hopefully by the time you're watching this, it'll still be live. I'm going to make full advantage of that as well. Um, because the coffee is really good. And I always feel like you can actually taste a difference with between coffees. Um, it's just really smooth. But anyway, I'm rambling. Let's get to berries. So, I have just got home from... A lovely morning, a really lovely Friday actually. Start the day off. I have done my one rebel class, which is incredible. Really fun. Sorry, a Barry's class, which I really enjoyed. It was just a very weighted, weighted class, which was really fun. And then I went to a meeting with my lovely friend Lavanna, who works for Elizabeth Arden, Revlon, um, Mitch Mitchum deodorant and All Saints fragrance. They also look after Juicy Couture fragrance and Britney Spears fragrance as well. So it was really lovely to really get a feel for the products and just kind of get a personal conversation about it, if that makes sense. I feel like as a content creator, I get sent quite a lot of products. Really nice to actually have like a personal chat with the people who work for the brand and 
really get their feel for it and have a bit more of a conversation about the products and I think it gets you a bit more excited and a bit more invested into them. Um, sorry, I have literally just put a whitewash on, so I will go through the brand, the products with you maybe later on. That was a really lovely morning, and we also went to Plants, which Plants is owned by Deliciously Ella. And actually, when we got the receipt, it was really lovely actually. So if you are a big fan, you can see the mess. The mess in the background is just ridiculous. So when we got the receipt, they kindly gave us all her new her new products which are sold out everywhere except of course her place so these are the deliciously ella cashew and cranberry trail mix bars she kind of gave us a couple each and then we were talking about these hershey cups and they were like oh here you go try them out so really lovely stuff the stuff with the loveliest food was incredible incredible for allergies we went for breakfast but apparently the lunch and dinner is amazing there as well so yeah plant-based but you are not missing out on taste because it is a delicious but anyway i'm cracking on with work now i actually want to film i actually want to film a friday get ready with me um, doing the makeup look I did for when I was in Paris, which was this Rosie Huntington dark lip vibe. I absolutely love it. So I'm going to remove my makeup actually with, actually with a new cream. Um, where did I put that? With a, well, not a new makeup remover, but I haven't really shown you this actually, I don't think for a very long time. This is the Elizabeth Arden Ceramide Replenishing Cleansing Oil, and it is 195 milliliters and it is only i believe 24 pounds this lasts forever forever the light has come in very lovely into my bathroom so it is a cleanser i've actually used previously before but i haven't for a very long time and i say this because i have been using so many different products because i kind of get sent quite a lot um, so I go through quite a few, but it is a it is a cleanser that I absolutely adored years ago, and I just haven't had it since because obviously I like I said I kind of get sent quite a lot of products to try it out. But when Lavanna got this out today, I was like, I am so excited to be reunited with this cleanser because it is beautiful. So like I said, this is the Ceramide Replenishing Cleansing Oil by Elizabeth Arden, and it is huge and you only need one pump because i believe that the oil cleansers are the best because they really pick up all the dirt and makeup on your face so you literally just need one pump like that and you'll see i need to remove my ring it literally just glides off the makeup which is incredible and i know i've just done my makeup and i'm redoing it but i really wanted to go go to this meeting because i haven't seen lavanna in a very long time i also really wanted to do this friday get ready with me so this was kind of like a slapdash makeup look anyway so i'll redo my makeup and then i'll get on with some more filming but i usually do my friday get ready with me every week just recently haven't been inspired so yeah i really want to do this look and if you didn't know that i do these i do them try and do them every friday on my instagram stories which is like kind of doing a step by step of a makeup look and my makeup hasn't really changed recently so i haven't been really inspired however i really liked my makeup look for the ellie saab show so yeah i thought i would do that with you guys so i'm just getting a cloth and i can see it's already picked up loads is amazing so yeah it was a really lovely breakfast um and like i said before i've been really struggling mentally with just like the breakup and everything and i feel like with lavanna she's known me for many years now and um she's known me since i literally started doing instagram and so she knows i've been with my partner for a very long time and yeah and it was just really nice to Obviously, she's older than me. She's got a little baby now. And it was just really nice to speak to someone who's nice to speak to someone who, like, with a fresh mindset and things like that. So it, it, really, it was a really lovely morning, and I think I really needed it. So I was really, really grateful. I got to have the morning with Lavanna. Lots of lovely talks, lots of lovely food, and it was just oh, lovely. And talking about all these products, it's just very grateful for my job. Um... So yes, that was a really lovely morning. Now I've just got a couple of videos I want to film. 
Honestly, I love it. It just feels so hydrating, this oil. It's so lovely. And as you can see, I'm just doing a double cleanse because I always do a double cleanse. I feel like you do the first cleanse to get rid of the makeup and then the second cleanse is to properly like get rid of anything which is lingering on the face. Um, so that's what I'm doing right now. And then I'll put some skincare on with my Friday Get Ready With Me. And then we'll get this makeup look going. But yeah, what I'll do actually is maybe go through the products another day with you and kind of do like a skincare routine and talk to you about some of the Elizabeth Arden hero products. One of them I do really want to shout out is the Elizabeth Arden 8 Hour Cream. Um, this March, Elizabeth Arden are in collaboration with the Princess Trust. Um, so they are donating £5 every time the 8 Hour Cream is purchased. And it is Mother's Day at the end of the month, so if you haven't already got your Mother's Day presents, then maybe treat your loved ones to an Elizabeth Arden 8 Hour Cream, which is just my favourite product in the world. My family's holy grail, um, my brothers love it. We use it for everything, for dried lips, insensitive skin. We absolutely swear by it and it's just been in our family for years. So it's a lovely product that you know your mum, your nan, your sister, whoever was like your mother figure in your life would absolutely love. And it's like a hero product that everyone swears by. So yeah, I thought I'd just say that and I'll leave it down below because I absolutely love it. Um, but maybe over the weekend, I'll talk to you through how I use it. But anyway, I'm rambling now. All I do is ramble on this. I'm wearing actually, I'll quickly say that I'm wearing an uh, Because of Alice body and a me and M little cardigan which is keeping me warm with some really nice like tracksuit with some little tracksuit like smart trousers but anyway i'm gonna do this friday get ready with me and i'll catch you guys in a bit Good morning guys i hope you are doing well it is sunday and i've just got myself ready as i'm heading out the door i'm off to a pilates class at ride republic in parsons green and i'm very excited for just a morning stretch I've had a coffee, I've had a banana, she's ready to go. And then I'm meeting up with my friend Tula to go to my old favorite market, which is High Street Chem Market. It happens every Sunday. Um, if I can remember, I will leave the information down below. But also one of the um, stalls, they've just opened up a shop near the, near the markets. So we're gonna pop along to that because it's gluten-free, refined sugar-free, vegan, honestly delicious so Tula's also got quite a lot of allergies like oneself so I thought I'd take her along to that to treat her to something delicious there because it is so good so yeah that will be my lunch so very much excited just to mooch around there's some things in Zara home that I've seen that I might pick up and I need to get a present for my dad's birthday from Massimo Duty, which I thought get him something like a spring shirt or something like that would be really lovely. Um, so yeah, so that is the plan of action for today. So I thought I'd take you along because I feel like it's going to be a very lovely, wholesome day. Fit wise, I'm wearing my skincare, and then I've just got a jumper on from um, River Island, my mango coat, my little pastel Pauline bag, and my Vasia trainers, and then I'm wearing my YSL sunglasses. So. Very lovely, minimal makeup, a lovely girl's day, just chilling. What time do you call this? <laughs> the vloggers in the wild. <laughs> Who is it? My little nephew. Hi, baby. <laughs> Hi, sweetie. This has got such a nice texture. Hey, guys. Um, so, I've got to, the girls um, with me finished my um, yoga class we, we just went and got coffee from a deli that has just opened up she had a place on the farmers market which is like high street ken um so i went and said, showed my face and like congratulated her it was really lovely but now we're gonna head to um the market to then meet my other friend who owns another company called eat so definitely go and check the high street ken market out because it is so cute and pretty um lovely organic food and it's just such a lovely sunday activity to do so i feel very wholesome with my yoga my coffee my friends and now going to the market which will be lovely um so yeah what a wholesome little sunday oh, oh my god so it's like a nachos <laughs> <laughs> 
you done? You can take me home.